exact flat boot Solid Wars World 2014, which what you say, design, flatten, nest, and actually cost also. That's correct. So design, exact flat automates the design and prototyping of products covered in fabric. Things like car seats, furniture, uh, composite parts, uh, accessories, consumer goods, and things like that. It is the only add-in for SolidWorks that specifically addresses a new large growth market, which is soft goods. Our product is bought by automotive sector, for example. This is an automotive seat. Car interiors, aircraft interiors. And it represents an opportunity for SolidWorks to extend its customer base to manufacturers who are using these types of materials. There's SolidWorks for plastic, there's SolidWorks for metal, there's SolidWorks electrical, SolidWorks plant layout, and now SolidWorks fabric. And what's unique about us is we're the only one. So this is about 10 years of development and proprietary algorithms that solve very complex processes like fabric stretch, and it works exactly like the SolidWorks interface. So you can see it's integrated in. Here's our toolbar right here. Exact flat. This is our tool set. It's not even a new product. It's a new set of features. So it's uh, very complementary to SolidWorks simulation, very complementary to SolidWorks PDM, very complementary to base SolidWorks design. And we should be the best in show. So what kind of, what kind of time savings or um, also material savings do your customer actually get? Do you, do you have a... This is an example from a customer. This is a design shop in uh, Portland, Oregon. And they make, uh, their customers include Nike, Microsoft, Apple, uh, NASA, US military. So this is an example of a, a prototype bag. This bag would be made manually. They would make a physical foam block and they would take fabric and put it over top of this foam block usually. But this was modeled in SolidWorks in 40 minutes. And then they used exact flat to process the patterns and send it to a cutting table, cut so, in 40 minutes. So in about 90 minutes, they had this bag actually sewn up like this. How long would it take the traditional two way? Two days. Minimum of two days. How many tries to get it right? Uh, probably five or six. And this one was done once. once? First time. Wow. Now, what they would do next is they'd add features, they'd add the straps, they'd add little pockets, they'd add zippers and things like that. So there'd be some more design time. Right. But that's typically the savings. We look at anywhere from one-fifth to one-tenth of the time. So for a car manufacturer, if he needs that to... That car seat would take right. about two weeks. Mm -hmm. We can have the, the product cut, sewn, and on the block in about four hours. Wow. Yeah, you can see so that. It's, it's, it, I mean, it's the same uh, time improvement that you'd have for uh, sheet metal using SolidWorks versus like, you know, hand fabrication. Things like that. You have different levels? We have different levels. So we have a basic product, which is just 3D to 2D flattening. Yep. It's flattened anything, any type of material, any type of surface. Composite, uh, synthetic, natural fiber, metal, doesn't matter what so it you is. You have a library of materials that uh, we have some, taken we have consideration. Of materials, correct. So for stretching and that's right. And so that's the base product. And then we go up from there. So if you want to do patterning, add seam offsets, add zippers and things like that. If you want to do nesting, if you want to do costing, if you want to do documentation, then the price goes up from there. So how many modules do you have? Or five. Five, five, five modules? That's correct. And can you give me the price range from the cheapest so the to cheapest the most? the cheapest one is 5000 The most expensive one is 18000 18000 okay. Correct. And that's with the five different software packages together. Great. Thank yeah. you very much. Yeah. You're welcome.